Daniel Alfred Sanborn, a civil engineer and surveyor, began working on fire insurance maps in 1866. That year, he was contracted by the Aetna Insurance Company to prepare maps of areas in Tennessee. About the same time, he developed a similar map of Boston, which was published as Insurance Map of Boston, Volume 1, 1867. Seeing a lucrative market for this type of map, he established the D.A. Sanborn National Insurance Diagram Bureau in New York City to publish the Boston Atlas and develop and sell maps of additional areas. Sanborn maps provide many layers of information and can greatly assist in researching the history of individual properties as well as the evolution of incorporated areas of cities. Suburban areas were not usually mapped. Using the symbols found on Sanborn maps, you can uncover the history of a building or site. For example, each type of construction is color-coded. Yellow for a frame building, blue for concrete or cinder block construction, brown for adobe, etc. You can also determine if a structure was a dwelling or a business, how many stories it contained, and even where the windows were located. Because Sanborn maps were produced periodically, comparing maps of the same area in different years can show you how an area has changed over time. The Special Collections Department of the East Baton Rouge Parish Library has access to this rich resource in both print and online formats. Located in our digital library, the Fire Insurance Maps Online database can be accessed from home with a current East Baton Rouge Parish Library card. This interactive database is easy to use and contains maps from all over the United States. If you would like to view actual physical copies of the maps of Baton Rouge, you can come to the Baton Rouge Room located in the Special Collections Department on the second floor of the main library at Goodwood and an archivist will assist you.